Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody's having trouble with these lines, additional lines. I don't know. She and then they they sent me the file, and the file looks good. There's no lines in there, but they say it looks good in their Corel. But when they go to send it to their laser, it looks like this on the screen. The only thing I can figure out that it could possibly be when they welded it. And just an insight before I kind of show you how to do this. Uh, this is set for a hairline, so it's going to cut out. Uh, that's going to cut out, and then that's going to cut out. It's just going to be a big egg. So that is going to be basically non-readable. You need to think about that if you're cutting that. Now, if you're inlaying this and you're going to use the, the, the other wood to fill in that part, Everything else will kind of look, that'll look like an E for sure, but this is going to look like, a, well, the E is going to fall out too, completely. So the, 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 any of the interior parts are not going to be there. It's going to look like, let's just kind of show you, and they didn't ask for this, but I'm just going to kind of um, show them what it's going to look like. So if we take the virtual segment delete key, and you take that right there, that's what it's gonna look like after you cut it out, unless you're doing uh, some inlay work. So let's just get back to the lines. What I would do, and it's pretty easy and pretty safe to, to make sure those lines aren't there, or I would think this would make sure the lines aren't there. This graphic is almost 16 inches, we're gonna set our nudge factor to 16. And just by, you need to really set this at zero, zero. I've made many, many videos, of course, that's my opinion, and uh, it's just a pet pee of mine. But take the Smart Fill tool, and we can have none on their outline, and we can make it black, or there's two ways you could do this, but I'm gonna Smart Fill it and move it over. Smart fill it and move it over. And then let's zoom in here. Smart fill, move it over, move it over. I don't think they were having trouble with these letters because of the fact that uh, they are not, have been welded together. But now you can take the whole thing and left click, no fill, right click, red, and make sure it is a hairline. That should prop solve the problem. Here's another way while we're talking about the smart field tool. Let's grab the smart field tool. I don't like doing it this way, but we're going to say no fill and specify, specify an outline and call it a hairline and go ahead and make it red, RGB red. Corel does that sometime. A little irritating. And let's make it red. And then when we smart fill this, move it over, look at that. We don't have to take away the fill. We're just making an outline in the same thing with, you know, each letter. I don't like doing it this way, especially if you have a lot of parts because you can't really see if you're getting all the parts. I just soon have fill. But it worked. And it is a hairline. And... I hope they know. I hope they'll let me know if that fixed their problem. Smart fill to me is a lot better way, and this is a perfect example than uh, welding stuff. Anyway, hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for.